Good evening, everyone, and welcome back to this walkthrough of Assassin's Creed 2. This is Blackjack Kent, and we are in San Gimignano, um, and we have just killed all of the co-conspirators of Jacopo de Pazzi, and now it's time to start looking for the man himself. Um, I believe we've gotten pretty much everything in San Gimignano that we're going to right now, except all the side quests. Um, there's a couple of viewpoints that we'll probably get, but other than that, I think we're about ready to go. Um, maybe... Where am I? Is that a blacksmith there? Yeah, let's stop there first, and then go and just see if there's anything shiny to get... I can afford. Actually, I don't have a lot of money, so never mind. We'll just, we'll just go straight to the plot. Why not keep things moving right along here? This is a longish game, so might as well keep things moving. Um, yeah, I don't. I think the next plot is just us going to get Jacopo. I can't remember though. Um. Get down now! Go back down! Leave me alone! I'm going, I'm going, Jesus. <laughs> Hello, ladies. Such a grace. Right. Um. Um. Uh, in the right place, but not on the right level. So, up here? Aha! Yes, indeed. Alright, with friends like these, tail Jacopo di Pazzi to the Templar meeting and then assassinate him. This is one of the harder missions in the game, as measured by how many times I had to do it the first time. Um, we have to locate Jacopo, and we have to follow him without being caught, and it's hard. If I can stay my blade long enough to follow him, he'll lead me to his Templar brothers. I'll have more names for my least. So that's him over there in gold with the blue arrow above him. So we're going to go this way. Oh, shit. That wasn't what I wanted to do. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Okay. So, we're not notorious, which is good. It's the only person we have to- Shut up! Go away! Leave me alone! The only person we have to worry about alerting is Jacopo. But he'll occasionally stop and... What's going on here? Are they late? They haven't seen me, this much I know. So he'll start gathering guards up. Please leave me alone. Freaking... Yeah, my preferred method of getting rid of the minstrels is just to pickpocket them. It does technically make you notorious for like half a second, but I've never had a problem with it. In order to tail someone, you have to keep them in visual range. Um, if you lose sight of them, you see that counter comes up, that means that you have to get them back. Crap. Crap. You have to get them back within range within 25 seconds. Like so. Leave me alone, I haven't done anything. So we're going to follow Jacopo down this way. You want to avoid doing anything to attract attention to yourself. What are you and the others planning, Jacopo? Um, occasionally Ezio will talk to himself. You can blend with guards, you can piss off the minstrels. talking about? I can see him fine. He's right over there. Sometimes the count can get a little bit twitchy, like if he walks behind a pole or something, it'll start counting down even though you quite clearly haven't lost track of him at all. 
go ahead and denotorious size ourselves. So yeah, Jacopo is going to walk outside of the city. And becomes rather difficult to infiltrate the place where he is going because it is swarming with guards and is a uh, whatchamacallit what do they call it? Restricted area? So the guards get really twitchy if you go towards it and you have to I'll see if I remember the way to do it because as I said, Your it's letter mentioned Venezia. Are there Templars there as well? Yes, they are. We'll spend a lot of time in Venezia, actually. But not yet. So, yeah, we're going to follow him along here. There's some convenient little bars sticking out of the wall. Whoa, what are you doing, Ezio? Jump on the thingies. This will let us swing up along the wall and follow Jacopo this way. Jacopo is going to collect all of these guards walking along. Um. I don't remember. Ah, yes, okay. I think... I think... the strategy here involves... the use... <coughs> Ow, that hurt. The use of the group of thieves. Okay. Um, shit. Or maybe not. Maybe I just scoot along this way. How many men are responsible for my father's death? Eavesdrop on the meeting without being detected. We're gonna go this direction. Sweet. That was much easier than I remembered. <laughs> I'm sorry, Maestro. I did all I could. But the assassin proved too strong. Clearly. As the others would be here with you. Say nothing of the fact that Firenze remains in Medici hands. It's Francesco's fault. His impatience made him reckless. I, I tried to be the voice of reason. More like the voice of cowardice. You want to talk, Signor Barbarigo? Had you sent us quality weapons instead of this garbage you Venetians call armament? We put our faith in your family and you repay us with inaction and incompetence? Don't! Then when asked to account for your failures, you make excuses and insult us? How do you expect me to respond? I don't know. It's all right. I do. Uh, uh, don't! No. Please. No, don't. <laughs> Please don't what? I can fix this. <laughs> Spare me. No. So sorry to have claimed your prize, assassin. Uh -oh. Did you honestly think I wouldn't expect you to follow? That I didn't plan for it? We've been at this a lot longer than you. Kill him. I don't think so. I know you're only doing as you're told. So if you release me, I will spare your lives. Ha! Listen to this one! Ah! Oh! 
<laughs> yeah. Let's kick some Templar ass, bitches. Okay, we got these dudes with spears now. Maybe I'll see if I can show you how to do a disarm with those, because those can be fun. Or maybe I'll just kill another one. Uh, where's my weapon wheel? Hello. Health, health, health. There we go. No, what are you doing? Ezio! Oh, I hit the wrong button. Oh! Come on, Ezio. Get with it. Get with the program. No! Where the fuck did my sword go? Did I drop it? Ezio, you idiot! Um, okay. That's weird. I've never had that happen before. Finish. I'm supposed to finish Jacopo de Pazzi, but I can't really because these dudes are all kicking my ass. Shit. It's not good. Where's my sword? I want my sword back. Alright, fuck it. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Come on. Come on. Uh. Come on. That's better. Okay. Okay, Jacopo. You've caused me enough trouble. Vai amico, libero da fardelli e paure, requiesca di pace. All right, friends like these. So that's the end of that chapter, or memory sequence. Sequence 5 is complete, and now we can go... I forget what happens now. I guess we... Start the next sequence? There aren't so many parts in this game as in, this, as in Brotherhood where, uh, it's, or where Desmond actually gets out of the... Um, animus. I think it does happen at least once or twice more. But I don't think it's here. Nope, back to Firenze. Repubblica Fiorentia, Fiorentina. 1480, excuse me. Alright, so back to Florence in a different part of the city where I have not yet done any viewpoints so let's see oh we're up on the north here alright let's get this viewpoint here so we can see what we're doing uh, this direction so we're in a new area of the city now uh, we're a little north of the Duomo it looks like and we're gonna climb this tower over her Real quick. There we go. North side of the city. Whee! Okay, one thing we need to do actually, if there's one in the immediate vicinity, I used up a whole bunch of medicine during that last fight. Is there a doctor? Is there a doctor in the house? That's a little bit of a ways away. Alright, uh, we'll deal with that later. Memory start. Over this way. Uh, who are we going to talk to here? Might be... It's not Leonardo, is it Lorenzo? Yeah, Palazzo Medici, okay. Lorenzo! Lorenzo, my boy. Oh, this is where we get the key, the Medici cape. 